President Tsai Ing-wen came out to thank public school teachers, civil servants and government officials today for accepting her pension reform plans. Their lump sum pensions currently have an 18 percent preferential interest rate, which will now be gradually reduced, together with a raising of their retirement ages. The reforms were approved by the legislature this week. After the legislative passage of three bills relating to President Tsai Ing-wen's radical pension reform plans, the President thanked all the retirees involved who will see their pensions dwindle as a result. I would first of all like to thank all my colleagues who are civil servants and educators. I thank them for being willing to undergo hardships and stabilize the country at one of our nation's most difficult times. I would especially like to thank all my colleagues who are retired educators and civil servants. Each of you have served our nation and society faithfully. Now you are once more helping the nation through a difficult moment. It is estimated that Tsai's pension reform plans will ensure 30 years of financial stability for teachers and civil servants' pension funds. We have proved that pension reform is not a governmental landmine. It's not so taboo that it can't be touched. Furthermore, my pension reform plans will not leave anybody unable to make ends meet. I will take on all the pressure of pension reform. All the blame will also fall on me. If we can complete such a difficult and complicated reform as that of the pension system, there's nothing that we Taiwanese people cannot do. After more than a year in office, opinion polls have shown that President Tsai's popularity is plummeting. Her successful enactment of the pension reform may yet give her popularity a boost.